everyone and welcome back to Until Dawn. I hope you guys are excited for this because I love this game. Um, that being said, we're gonna hop right into it. So if you like it, if you like it, you dislike it, you dislike it. But we are just going to hop straight back into this with chapter two. Oh. Well, I guess we gotta go back to this. Whatever. You guys think this is a little bit? Oh, come on. Let me out. <laughs> What's going on? Kick the wall. It was just a prank, Han. I... I can't skip. <laughs> Fortunato avocado. Oh, I actually First want to do something second. I gotta say, I am super excited to welcome <laughs> all my pals yeah. back to the annual Blackwood Winter Getaway. I really want to spend some quality time with each and every one of you and um, just share some moments that we'll never forget for, Help me for the sake of my sisters. I need to go find Sam. Whoa, hello. Somebody's getting the important the ones, the healthy ones. So I am chips. To the back. And, next and then the also healthy ones. How we met. Boom. Dark and gummy burgers. Butterfly effect. But yeah, I love nerds. But who doesn't love pure sugar? Man, I feel like this mountain gets bigger every time I climb it. Oh yeah? That feels the same to me. Love of my life! Josh, Hannah and Beth's brother, he's complex, thoughtful, and loving. Just Come like on, in real life. Here. It's, probably feels like it's shrinking. I guess that's true. When are you gonna install some cell towers up here? I'm getting withdrawals already. You got a spare million lying around, and I'll fix you right up. Funny you should say that. I, I think I left it in my other jacket. Hey, where did his bag go? Hey, gang. You guys get up here okay? <sighs> Could have done with some bellboys, but, uh, hey. Can't get everything. Yeah, it was pretty easy. A little creepy, though. I mean, it's just really weird being back here. Yo, 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 we get things moving up here or what? Yeah, man. I uh, got it. So Matt and Emily are a thing now, right? Yeah, so it seems. I mean, what's Mike think of that? I have a feeling Mike's already got his hands full, you know what I mean? <laughs> huh. Damn it. It's a freaking thing. It's iced. What else? Maybe there's another way in. There are a million ways in. They're just all locked. There's gotta be like a window around the corner we can get like get open or something. Wait a second. Are you saying we should break in? <laughs> I don't think it's technically breaking in if you own the place, right? Hey. Not if I don't report you. Um <laughs> Lead the way, coaches. Hi, Chris. Uh confident. So, how are you doing? Good, but a little cold. I think I could use some time curled up by the fire. Yeah, that does sound pretty nice. Mm-hmm. <laughs> uh, saying Cochise, I'm pretty... Cochise? <gasps> oh, I told him! I told him! Are you sure saying Cochise is just, like, another way of saying chief to someone? Don't quote me on that. I am sorry? No, replay. How the hell does this man even get in this situation? Um, yeah, I'm pretty sure... I'm pretty positive on that, but, like, don't quote me on that. But, yeah, it's just, like, I'm pretty sure it's just another way for, like, people to go around calling people chief, because, you know, that happens very often. These things are fucking addictive. Will you just talk to him already? Matt! Been a while. Call weird without your helmet and jersey. Yeah, been a tough one. Good to see you. Uh, just be friendly. So how's it hanging? Pretty good, man. Can't complain. You? Oh, you know, same old, same old. Cool. Y'all are so fucking awkward. Is what it, is this what it's like to have friends? I couldn't tell you. I only have one friend, and he's... We only talk, like, every oh. few months for the yeah. course of a year. Um, yeah. Cool. 
Coco. How's, uh, how's she doing? She's fine. Why? No reason. God, you guys are so fucking awkward. Let's go, Josh. This is what I mean, but I need to make sure I'm diligent and checking everywhere. I could have missed that if I just followed Josh. He could have just been gone. Never to be found again. Ashley was looking pretty hot today, right? Hell yeah. She's like a sleeper hit kind of gal, you know? And I just want to rip that Parker right off of her and make some snow angels, right? That's such a weird way of saying that. Yeah, agree. We know he has a crush on her. Uh, absolutely. When are you going to take her to the bone zone? <laughs> like, that could ever happen. Come on, That's man. Gross. She practically spends her entire life with you as it is. Well, yeah, but we're like friends. Listen, dude, look around you. Look at these beautiful mountains. Do you see any parents? I mean, can you imagine a more perfect, ripe scenario just dripping with erotic possibilities? You and Ashley alone at last. You've laid all the groundwork. You've been a perfect gentleman. Now you come in for the kill. You know what? You're right. This is the best friend. This is the and wingman right. he's looking for. You're a hunter, bro. No fear. No mercy. I mean, she won't even know what hit us. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right. I got it. Jeez. So, how are we planning on breaking into my parents' lodge, bud? I didn't say I had a plan. You sounded like you had a plan. You better deliver, Coaches, or else you got... Four lovely ladies who are going to be freezing their buns off. And last time I checked, that's not a good way to get laid. Oh, shoot. Nobody likes cool buns. Uh... There seems to be a missing axe here. Can we walk up this way before we do that? Anything even up here? No? I'm getting pretty low in juice here. I'm just gonna turn off my GPS. I'm finally <laughs> like outside where I might actually use it. Can you cool it on the phone, Tom? What? Why? It's pretty much all you talk about. Well, you know, I mean, I could do all this stuff and. Well, you got an app that can get us into the lodge? Nope. Got an app that can get you laid? Well, actually, dude, there's this... you don't. The answer is that you don't. <laughs> I don't know if I've ever heard that before. Well, 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 we got ourselves a thinker. Nice one. Ooh. Why is there even an open window? Okay. Should have paid more attention in climbing class. You mean Jim? Yeah, you know, with the climbing up the rope. They even still do that. Well, I don't think they do. I, I don't think so. Here, use this. Whoa, Chris, I just got an awesome idea. Yeah? Totally. What is it? Okay, so I'm pretty sure that I've got some deodorant in one of the bathrooms. You could use that with the lighter. I, I don't follow. How's, it, how's a stick of deodorant going to help? Spray on. It's a can. Oh, yeah. Now I got gotcha. you. Flamethrower. Just like we did with the little army dudes. Yep. Ones we melted. Just point the spray can in the lighter and whoosh. <laughs> bye bye, frozen lock. Bingo. All right, so you got this. I'm going to go sort something out. You up for hunting around in the dark for a little bit? Nope, but I'll do it. <laughs> Godspeed, Pilgrim. Uh, Rami Malik is such a dork. Okay. Look at that, another totem! We are on a roll, guys. 
Emily's dead. Emily is dead. Why is she dead? How is she dead? Well, obviously we know how she did, but what events lead to her being dead? <laughs> Rats. Gonna look around everywhere for things, for clues. I would love a Scooby Doo based game like this. Where you walk around, where you get to be the different characters, and you get to just like look for clues in a in a thing, I think that'd be awesome. So what have we here? Also, I'm really sorry for eating on camera. I just I need to snack on things. I've barely eaten anything all day, and bro, I've got a hypoglycemic. My, uh, my blood sugars are gonna knock me the fuck out. Oh, that's cool. Mommy Malik looks like such a sweetie here. The hell was that? A door closing, obviously. Like, that's a really stupid question. Not like the microphone can't be used right now. Try again later. Wasn't trying to use the microphone to begin with. Okay. You hear that whispering? I swear, with headphones on, I can hear everything. Seriously, it sounds like somebody's whispering. The girls, they're freezing their bums off. Hurry! Hi, Chris. Very funny. Oh, how'd you know it was me? Shouldn't you be, like, getting the lock open or something? On it. Man, no TV. Whack. Obviously, this game's been out for a while. You guys probably already know what the monster is. I will not be pronouncing said monster's name right throughout the entirety of this game. In case you weren't aware, I am in fact Native American. And we have the belief that if you say the name, you attract these monsters to you. And, um... Yeah, I'm not down for that. That actually freaks me out entirely. I don't care if you believe they're real. I am of the up. Uh, I have the opinion that these that these things can be attracted to me, and I'd much rather they were not. Okay. God, there's so many things to explore in here. I don't want to try to open that door yet, but I saw this thing here. And I wanna wanna look at it. Prom photo. Ready for the senior prom. In 2013! Damn. They graduated... They graduated... When did they graduate? Six years before I did? Why does his yeah, finger message. bend like that? Do a message. Hi, Mrs. Washington. This is Sergeant Tate again. It's bad news, I'm afraid. Yeah, we've been through the case file, and there's nothing we can do. He's a free man. We don't have the legal power to restrict his movement. Uh, I know it's not what you wanted to hear, so call me if you want to know more. That's rather unfortunate. Okay. Well, let me walk through here. Now, lock in. Okay. Before we go up these stairs, or down the stairs for that matter, we need to make sure we're not missing nothing. Adventure is up there. I watched Up earlier, and I love that movie so much. Pixar in general, they're just perfect. 
Anything? Some creepy artwork there. Okay, I guess not. Let's go, let's go downstairs. Uh, do not just walk right back upstairs. Oh my god. <laughs> Immediately, there is something in front of us. Oh, it's another picture. Josh with his lovely sisters. In my room. Damn. A dedicated cinema room with surround sound would be awesome. Imagine playing a game in there. Really take immersion to the next level, you know? Especially with like a horror game. Can't interact with that door. Right, it's fucking hot. <laughs> okay, there's literally nothing else down here. Eh, what a waste of my time. Well, it's not really a waste of my time. I found one thing. But one is not enough. Okay, so I guess now it's just to go upstairs. Man, that bath, though. Like, that we saw on the camera, which is so really weird that there's a camera. Where, um, in the bathroom. Why is there a camera in the bathroom? Start to a weird porno. I guess Josh did say, let's party like we're fucking porn. This, this is creepy. You should shut those. And lock them. They're still whispering everywhere, and it's making me very uncomfortable. Over here. I'm sorry, I'm just trying to be very thorough with looking around for things. Um, ba -da -dum, da -da -da. So for almost every game you see me play on this channel, I have never finished. I've never finished by myself. I would, I like start them, but then I, do, I just don't continue them because I get too scared or something else comes up. I just never finish them. So this is me actually, this, this channel is just a way for me to like, make sure I finish the games. Give me the chance to play games I'd always wanted to play, but either didn't have the motivation to finish, and or was too scared to play by myself. Like, you guys are just here to help me. Like, you guys are here to help me motivated. And, um, you know, help me figure out what order to play games in. <laughs> I feel like we need to go in that door. Oh, there. This is a big. This is a big lodge. How y'all? What do you do with this much space? Music's building up, and I'm not here for it. What is that noise? You look at that bathtub. Ugh. I want a bathroom like this. This would be a dream bathroom. Like, I'd still want a shower, but, like, this is a dream bathroom. Perno for men. <laughs> How did that get- I guess we did see an open window, didn't we? How did it get in the cupboard? We're freezing our buns off out here. And I'm coming. 
I had to find everything. I had to, I had to look. Being thorough. I'm peeling. Oh. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I'll, I'll be here all week. <laughs> uh, crap, that thing freaked me out. What was it? Are you okay? It was like a bear or a tiger or something. Oh, it was just a cute little baby Wolverine. Baby? Don't worry, buddy. You're gonna be a big boy soon. You're gonna be a big boy soon. Home sweet home. Sweet is not the word I use. Oh my gosh, it's so good to be inside. Even if it's still kind of freezing in here. I'll get a fire going. This place barely looks any different. Yeah, nobody's been up here. Even with all the police coming in and out? N not a lot of action up here lately. No. What's up, party people? Hi. Hey. Hey. Hey, man. Make yourself at home, bro. Will do. Uh, what's the butterfly effect? What is the update? Gonna be as Matt. Ashley discouraged Matt from using the telescope. Matt didn't see Mike and Emily flirting. Therefore, Matt was relaxed and Mike and Jessica arrived at the lodge. Goes not to shoot the squirrel and nature remained in balance. Sam respected Chris's privacy. Chris was happy to see Sam. Chris continued to trust Sam. Oh, that's good. I Well, I'm assuming it's good. E, we're doing good, guys. We're doing good. 420 clues found. Thanks for that yet. Or 430 clues found. Okay. And we're doing good. Fuck yes. Enough. The goal is to find all the totems. Oh my god, that is so gross. <laughs> Are you trying to swallow his face whole? Damn. I mean, seriously, can she be any more obvious? No one wants in on your territory, honey. Excuse me? Did you say something? Oh, did you not hear me? Was your sluttiness too loud? Sounds like someone's bitter she didn't make the cut. Yeah, it's all a big cattle call with that dream boat. Congrats, you're top cow. That's real deep calling <laughs> this homecoming a cow. Uh... Provoke. Hey, hey, you're making everyone uncomfortable, Jess. Jealous much? Emily too frigid for you too. Hey, that's that's unco look whatever. I don't give a crap what you think. At least I can think. 4.0 bitch. Honor roll. Suck on that when you're trying to sleep your way into a job. Who needs grades when you've got all the natural advantages you can handle? Oh, you, well, you couldn't buy a moldy loaf of bread with your skanky ass. Are you serious? Do you think that's insulting? That bitch is on crack or something. Uh, you know, decide with your girlfriend. Shut your mouth. Jessica, you need to shut your mouth, okay? No, you're the one who needs to keep your nose out of other people's business. I'm about to get right up in your business, you bitch. Are we about to get real? Because I am down to get real. Stop it. Yeah, fight. This is not why we came up here. This is not helping. It's not what I wanted. If we can't get along for 10 minutes, then maybe we need a little bit of a break, right? Mike, why don't you check out the guest cabin, the one I told you about? Yeah. Yeah, all right. You want to go do that? Any place without that whore. I suggest. Right up the trail. <sighs> well, that's over. Yeah. So, Josh, uh... Should we get this fire going? Where's my bag? Huh? My bag, the the little bag with the pink pattern, the one I got on Rodeo. Matt, are you, are you listening? Oh my God, don't you remember? Next to the Italian shoe place where I got the stilettos and you knocked over the rack while you were drooling all over that girl at the counter? Well, I mean, she was asking about my letter jacket. Right, because she gave a shit about your designer letter jacket. Why do you hate my jacket? Matt, I need my bag. Oh my god, Em, maybe you just forgot it. Do you seriously think I'd forget my bag? Well, god! Jill! Guess not. You must have left it down by the cable car station. <sighs> Come on, hon. We'll be back soon. Then we can get warm. 
keeping it very warm. Ew. Right. Okay. I get it, Jordan Fisher. Okay. Let's go. I can knees fucking hurt my dudes. Okay, I'm gonna go take a bath. And y'all are really splitting up. And we know how that goes, guys. Oh, exiled. Sexiled. <laughs> Works for me. Oh, far. How far is this cabin anyway? This cabin is the coziest, most romantic love den you will ever lay your eyes upon. If we ever make it. I have a feeling luck's on our side. Play your cards right and maybe you will get lucky. Hey, porn stars. Gonna need these. Porn star? I'd pay to see you. Uh, gross. Hey, I'm sorry to kick you out like that. No worries, man. Oh, I'm sure you'll find a way to entertain yourselves. Mm -hmm. You have fun with the peanut gallery. <laughs> oh, I almost forgot. Gotta fire up the generator so you can see where you're going. It's dark out there. All right. Roger that. I think Josh was flirting with me. Okay. You want to invite him up with us? Wait, really? What? No. Give me a second. I'm, I'm exploring. I want to make sure we're not missing anything. With our luck, there would be something up here that we could miss. Meow, meow. That's my baby said. Meow, meow, meow. I saw something. Hey, hot lips, photo booth. Hot lips. All right, read my mind. Good. Find everybody on accident with the. Oh my god, <laughs> this is perfect. We're like the cutest couple. Damn. You should be a model. You keep that camera handy, and maybe I'll let you start my portfolio at the cabin. Wink. Noted. <laughs> Y'all are weird. Is this what teenage flirting is like? Put it now. Burr, it is freezing out here. Only uh, ever been called a whore. And how are you gonna do that? Because men couldn't keep it in uh, their pants. I got a few things in mind. So, like, teenage boys have a hard time keeping it in their pants, and then their friends get mad at you for their friends being weird. And this is a PSA. Don't sleep within your... Don't don't date within your friend groups. Kind of weird. Emily's as dumb as she looks if she thinks she can cut in on what we got going on. Maybe if we're lucky, she'll try and follow us out here and get eaten by a bear. I agree. I think you bring out the worst in her. Is that so? Epic jealousy. Suck it. I'm sure he'll suck something. Okay, uh, this is the way we need to go. So, I don't know if this will open. Huh. Oh, Guess no this power. needs juice or something. Okay. Didn't Josh say there was a generator? Yep, yep, we're going, we're going. A totem! Is that red? Oh my god, Ash! Freaking generator to work. I have, give me a I'll, second. I'll just yell at it like you're yelling at me. Let's see if that works. A little snarky. Was there anything in here? No, just the general. Alright. Let's see. Boom. Nice one, Mikey. Nice. You are a wizard. 
Creepy man in a mask outside. No tanks. No tanks. La da 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 da. Zam! The gates shall open. Pretty good, right? Yeah, totally. That was just awesome. Oh yeah. She does have a nice ass. She does have a nice ass. <laughs> you psyched yet? You don't look psyched yet. I am so psyched right now. <laughs> it's like a little adventure, a sexcapade. Wow. I swear they tried to make this as embarrassing as possible. Hannah and Beth. I think they'd clean it up. Well, they never closed the investigation. Okay, I'm getting the creeps now. Her eyeshadow's pretty. You're respectful. Well, wherever they are, I'm sure they're happy we're all thinking about them. That's a nice way of thinking about it. I hope so. Girls didn't deserve to die the way they did. I don't like that noise. Did you hear that? I heard something. Something. Yeah. Okay. Keep a sharp eye out. Damn. I don't think we can get up to the cabin with a path block like this. Oh, no way am I going back to the lodge, aka wax museum, to drink hot chocolate with Emily. You know what? Fuck it. We're adventurous. What? <laughs> yes! Fuck. Oh. Hey, Jessica! Yes. Hey. I'm um, okay. Holy crap, you scared the heck out of me. How do you think I felt? Uh. Her hair's really you cute that way. As far as I can tell, I still have all seven of my limbs. <laughs> seven? She is she counting these? Is she counting these as part? That's weird. Uh, yeah. Can you get out? I, uh, I don't know. I can hardly see anything down here. I'll jump down. Heroic. All right, coming after you. Just stay put. <laughs> Behind you! Behind you! Hey, handsome! Wanna help me move this cart thing? No. Obviously, yes, I will. Let's go. Yeah, those things are really fucking heavy. I imagined us grunting together. This is not what I pictured. <laughs> To be fair, that was kind of funny. It was kind of funny. Oh, I hate mines, though. Things are always fucked in the mines. Why would you not just move out of the way? Oh my gosh, are you okay? Uh, yep. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, I'm fine. So why would you not just move out of the way? Also, do you really need to stand directly on the tracks? Oh, Nelly, this place is giving me the willies. They're not the good kind of willies. What are the good kind of willies? I offer you a little comfort and reassurance. <laughs> we'll save it for the cabin, Buster. Hotem! Is that white? Jessica, you're naked. Why are you naked? Well, oh, wait, wait a minute. They're going to the cabin to get a little sexy time on, so that's probably why she's naked. What the fuck was that in the background? Was there anything else over here? Was that it? I think that was it. Okay. Bow, bow, wow. That's what my baby said. Bow, bow, bow. 
I really want to watch Phineas and Ferb. Ferb, I know what we're going to do today. Pretty then. Sure, we explore for everything. Huh. That was a good one. Weird place to hang out and smoke cigars. <laughs> Some racing. Wonder who's out there. Yeah, who's willingly smoking cigars, by the way, though? This place is like historical. Holy bat cave. It's gotta be Native American, right? I don't think the miners were getting their arts and crafts on, no. <laughs> I just looked good. You alright? Yeah. Close one. I'm a little panicked when I see stuff dripping from the ceiling after after yeah, playing Alien Isolation. Time to go. Go in a minute. I miss Lauren. And that way. Doing there's something on this table. What is it? It's a map! Jesus. That's a lot of blood. This is a real fixer rubber. Yeah, that's a lot of danger. Danger, danger, danger. Danger zone. What's your guys' favorite movie series? I have quite a few of them. Obviously, Nightmare on Elm Street's up there. Um. And uh, the Mummy series. I love the Mummy. Brendan Fraser. Honestly. Gotta keep a good eye out. Shit, which way do we go first? Up to right. Up to right. Up to right! Now, see, that seems like the way I want to go, which means I'm going this way. We're on fire, guys. Jess doesn't have her jaw. What do we have to do to save Jess? Why doesn't she have her jaw? All things considered, Jess is a little bitchy, but I don't want her to die. These are teenagers. Friday, Friday, gotta get down on Friday. That being said, my phone is letting me know that my bedtime is in like 5, 15 minutes. And I say bedtime is because usually I have to get up early for work. But it's the weekend, so therefore my bedtime doesn't exist. I do what I want. I live on the edge of danger. I need a fan over here. It's actually super fucking hot. Hold on. I'm gonna go grab one real quick. Okay. I hope you guys can't hear my fan, but if you can, I'm sorry. Oh, wow. Oh, well, when Josh said cabin, I felt like Abe Lincoln. <laughs> Where do you see the Lincoln bedroom? Oh, are you planning on getting presidential on me? <sighs> Take a ride on Air Force One? <laughs> all right, all right. Save for the stump speech, buddy. You're weird. You're so weird. Oh, a telescope. Gonna look at the trees. Gonna look at the clouds. Gonna look at the cabin. Um. Whoa. You all right? I just saw someone at the cabin. Okay. <laughs> Let me see. Jump scare. Hey Jess. Mm -hmm. Oh. Stay close by, okay? Wolves, bears, and uh, mountain elk. This posting says there's some brown bears up here sometimes. Oh, Michael, I have, I have the, the best idea. What? Let's go hug a bear. Come on, please. Come on. Let's. Not hug a bear. Hug a bear. Because as Smokey the Bear says, only you can prevent forest fires. Okay. I just wanted to make sure we weren't missing anything else up here. After you, me lady. Up 
Uh, this is a lot of walking for a cabin, or the guest cabin at that. Keep this music. What is this preparing me for? There's elk! Fucking birds! Just dancing made it cool. Wow, you're easy. Yeah. <laughs> Got a lot of love to give. <laughs> yeah. Scared. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Sorry, I thought I heard somebody come in through the front door. <laughs> what a keeping a way out, mate. I like your funny words, magic man. <sighs> Damn it, Josh. You have at least cleared out the path before sending us up here. Really? What? I didn't figure you for the glass half empty type. You got a better idea? Damn back, Debbie Downer. Oh, boo! Show off. Hey, Mike. You've got something on your face. <sighs> oh. Okay. Okay. Well, that's how it's gonna be. Where'd you go, Jess? Yes. Yes. Is she okay? Did Jess get attacked? Is this where she dies? Debbie! What? You wanna help me get this fire going? Uh, well, I was just getting into the bath. Oh. Oh, do you need any help with that? Hardy har. You turn it all the way up and hope. Come on. All right, Josh. Let's see if you know how to hook up the hot water in your big fancy lodge. Oh yeah, it's probably turned off to help to help keep the pipes from freezing. Does she find anything different than what Chris found? This bathroom is magnificent. There's a whole ass couch in the bathroom. He's fucking, ah, this bathroom is magnificent! I don't like that noise. What was that? That's a good question. What was that? What was that? Wait. So, doing a little bit of walking around, a little bit of exploring to find things that Chris might have, we might have missed as Chris. I can't say that Chris might have missed it because we were playing Chris. This door was locked before, though. Pretty art. A lot of butterflies. Johnny Smith, tattoo artist. Cute. She's got a tattoo. Anna Washington. Do we just look in that? There's nothing in there that we can interact with. Crash much? Friendship bracelets. Oh, I actually have to back out. I thought I was just gonna drop it for me. God, look at this bedroom. This bedroom is fucking insane. Hello, could this be any more about Mike? Looks 
the compatibility test. I remember doing those things all the time. Ugh. Glad none of those crushes ever worked out. <laughs> An amazing bedroom here. I kind of love the layout. This is giving me Hannah Montana vibes. You are invited to Sam's Halloween party. No, oh, that's that's the that's the card. I love that wallpaper. It was an accent wall. That's nice. I'm so sorry. I actually hit the microphone. Okay, so that's the bathroom. Yada. Let's go. That's just a blank wall behind us. For everyone. Tick tock goes the clock, and what then shall we Do see? We believe in you. Yeah, totally. Woohoo! Oh, it's the. Let's go, Josh. Let's go. You can do it. Okay. Uh, will you. Damn. This camera angle. It's not letting me walk. Just trying to. Just trying to double check everything here. Sure, we're not missing nothing. There's a different angle to look at everyone down below. Hello down there. Oh, the fire's going. At least that's going for us. Still locked. Stuck on a wall. All right, peanut gallery. You know what? I got an idea for you now. What? I'm not ready to know what it is yet. I'm still exploring. Oh, look, the window's closed now. Okay, well, I'm pretty sure that somewhere in this crazy place we used to have a spirit board. A one. Wow, you have a spirit board? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Ouija board. board. Right? Those things are a joke, man. They don't do shit. No way, bro. I mean, we used to do it all the time, me and... Well, Josh, no hot water's kind of major oversight, don't you think? Yeah, yeah, you just gotta fire up the boiler, it's in the basement. Alright, you guys, see if you can find the spirit board. Chris, let's go find it. It'll be like a scavenger hunt. Um, okay, guess so. Brad, you're not gonna regret it. You up for a ride along? Uh, right along to where? TV still don't work? Sorry, give me a minute, Josh. I gotta, gotta do some, some more exploring. Josh is just... Bobby Malik is just... <sighs> I could just, you know, just swim. These are some really ugly curtains. <laughs> Whoa, I didn't even see the chandelier the first time. Made of fucking antlers. No new messages. No new messages. Would we have been able to hear the message that Chris heard if um if uh he didn't listen to it? I wonder. Oh, I wonder. Oh yeah, no, it's literally just. Well, does she have anything different to say about it? No. Okay, let's see, let's see. Nice headshot of Josh. I'll be down with you in a minute, Josh. Just doing a quick loop-de-loop, -loop, make sure. And then we know there was, we're pretty sure there was nothing else down here, considering I'm pretty sure Chris only saw that hey, one thing. Notice how I gave Chris and Ash a mission together? Yeah, I was thinking they could use some alone time. Are sweet together. They are very sweet together. 
I wish they'd just freaking get on with it already. I swear, they just need, like, something to bond over, you know, some sort of traumatic event to send them into each other's arms. I mean, at this rate, they'll be in the geriatric ward before Chris makes a move. <laughs> Sounds about right. You have anything to say about this picture? No? Ah, uh, okay. The cinema room. Give me a second, Josh. I'm just looking around real quick. God, this is a lot of space. What would you ever need this much space for? I like that angle. You know, Sam. Yes, Josh? I just wanted to say... Uh, <sighs> what? It really means a lot to me that everyone came back this year and you know that you came, Sam. Reassuring. Gosh, we're here for you. Really, whatever you need, whenever, we're all gonna make it through this. Together. I hope we uh, will. I want us to have a good time, you know? I can't make any promises, but with hope we will make it through this. Hey, watch your step. I think I can handle a little set of stairs. Man, this is this is a big lodge. What do you need all this space for? Sorry to drag you down into the bow. Oh, just get me some hot water and I'll be super fine. I mean, I wouldn't want you coming down here on your own, you know. Can I look around first? I didn't uh, mean to go this way. Definitely creepy down here. Yep. Not a place to be on your own. A baseball bat. Had a better swing. Uh, serious? What's that doing here? Is that yours? You bet it's mine. I used to play ball with my dad all the time. Of course, that was before he got too busy to hang out with me. Ah, well, save it for the couch, right? Okay, let me see what I can do with this old hot water machine. Let me look around! Let me look around. Can you, can you hold this? What was that? What was what? Just giant ear so I can see what I'm doing. You look around! I wanna look! What if there's a toad down here that I missed? God, this is like doing a gen in Dead by Daylight. Is it gonna do this heartbeat every single time we have to do a don't nice move? One. Okay, first things first. We gotta increase the water pressure before we get the boiler fired up. That sounds kind of complicated. No, it's actually pretty simple. Well, a big boiler. Let's try. Like it. <laughs> it's all right. Five, girl. I missed it. I didn't mean to, Josh. I love you. I'm so sorry. I I I took my hands off the controller for five seconds. That could be a lot of things. And I'm nice. What it? <laughs> I'm just just Josh and you. <laughs> oh, you were really freaked out. I wasn't scared. I was not scared. No, no, you just jumped because you wanted to squeeze in some aerobics? Fully. I totally wasn't scared. Don't be an a-hole, okay? I totally didn't jump. All I said 
was, what was that? Which is a totally normal reaction to hearing a super creepy noise <laughs> in a super creepy basement. <laughs> okay, okay, so you hear the Josh. What? All of a sudden it's like, weirdly regular. Not, not, nothing regular about it. Uh, I'll check it out. I'm gonna go check it out. What? Why? <laughs> you care for any face. No, it's, it's probably just, like, not anything. Uh, why don't you hold down the floor while I make sure. Okay, wh whatever you say, madam. Ah, yes, I can walk around now. <laughs> Strangers! Hey. What? Hey! What the hell? Who? You just got mopped. What? <laughs> nice. nice one. That was good. Wait, but why would you do that? There's all this cool old movie crap down here. What was I? Was I not supposed to take advantage of the opportunity? Are you? Are you serious? Were you in on this, putz? <laughs> no, but I, I wish I was. That was too good. That's how you know they're friends. I'm ready to admit that your dumb little prank may have a slight whip of humor in it. Joke master! Well, I, I said nothing about jokes. I said your prank, which was dumb. Holy crap, you were scared. Admit it. I was not! Come on, you totally pissed yourself. Josh. What in God's name are you wearing? I found my true calling. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Please tell me you're going to take a vow of silence. <laughs> okay, okay, did you at least find the thingy? Oy, 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 oy. Here's our one-way ticket for the spirit realm. You know what? You know what? No, no. I've just been through enough spooking for one night, okay? I see a hot bath in my crystal ball. Mm. All right? <laughs> Have fun. He ain't done oh, the court. Watch out for that, Josh. He's a schemer. Okay. Going back to uh, Mike and Jess? Nope. Why are we all boarded up now? I would like to understand your feelings toward people with fear, isolation, loneliness. Do you share this fear? Yeah, I do. There's a spider on the desk. The tarantula. Is that so? Because that's not reflected in the way you are playing your game now, is it? How so? They're gonna be like a scarecrow in here somewhere because fuck you. And for now, let us investigate your feelings toward other people in greater depth. What you value, what you respect in yourself and others. Which would you say was most important in a person? Loyalty or honesty? There's a needle on the desk! Loyalty. So you would tell a lie in order to be loyal to a friend, okay? I would. And what about loyalty versus charity? Loyalty. So you would sooner look after your friends before caring for those in greater need? Yeah, fuck those other people. My friends and family come first. Oh. Once again, I'm afraid we're out of time. We'll talk again soon. Obviously, that is the end of the chapter. So, I hope you guys are enjoying this. I love this series. 
I'm really sad that I missed the high five with Josh. I'm really sad about it. I hope that doesn't have any greater consequences. Uh, <laughs> so I don't remember. But yeah, that being said, I do hope you guys are enjoying this. If you like it, please let me know in the comments down below. Um, I haven't, asked, I haven't said this in a while, but if you have any video game suggestions, there is a Google form linked in my description down below. Here where you can leave it in the comments. I'm always looking to expand the list of like the list of games that you guys would love to see me play. They don't have to be horror games. I will play anything. Somebody suggested Arkham, the Arkham games. I love Batman. I'll play them at some point. I've also never played the Arkham games. I own all of them. I just have never played them. So, with that being said, I do hope you could. Just, yep. Words are hard. I hope you guys are enjoying this, and I will see you all in the next video. Bye bye.